first third-party app. We have a demo already up and running. Yes, we do. I'd love to invite someone on stage who can give us a lot more information and a real-life example. I'd like to ask our first business partner to join me. They're the very first company that we gave access to our APIs. Please welcome founder and chief community officer of Relay Rides, the world's first peer-to-peer car sharing marketplace. Shelby Clark, please come. Stop. Stop. Shelby, good to have you with us. <laughs> Very exciting new news. Obviously last year in November, GM, Adventure Arm, and OnStar announced an exclusive partnership with your team in the space of alternative, mo alternative mobile uh, sharing, which is interesting because we hear a lot about Zipcar and Hertz On Demand. How is Relay Rides different and unique? Sure. Um, well, the concept of Relay Rides is really simple. Uh, car owners can earn money uh, by renting out their car to people who need convenient, affordable transportation. So uh, the car owner sets the rates and availability, and Relay Rides provides a million dollar insurance policy uh, and technology to make it really safe and convenient. Um, and as Nick mentioned, OnStar gave us access to the API of the remote link. Um, and so that's allowed us to, uh, to access the, uh, the OnStar vehicle features. So that lets borrowers reserve, locate, and unlock OnStar enabled cars with nothing more than the smartphone. Um, so we're in the process of developing uh, Relay Rides mobile app, uh, which built on this API. And today we're really proud to, uh, to show for the first time uh, a demo of, of the app. Um, so this is not uh, what the final app is going to look like, but it should give you a, a, pr a pretty good view of the functionality that it will have. Um, and so we have a video that will allow me to uh, help me explain how it works. So car owners start off by going to the website at reallyrides.com, and here you can learn everything you know about Relay Rides, uh, including how our million dollar insurance policy keeps you safe, uh, or how much money you can make. So uh, the average car owner makes about 250 bucks a month, but every month we see people making over $1,000. Um, and then right on the website, you can really easily link your Relay Rides to your OnStar accounts, uh, and then you can control um, your hourly, daily, and weekly rates, uh, and your availability. Uh, so someone in need of a car um, can go to the, can check out the online marketplace, searching for a vehicle right in their backyard. Uh, maybe they need an SUV, carry a lot of stuff around, um, or a Volt for a, a fully electric trip. Um, our rates are uh, the most competitive in the industry, uh, with uh, prices starting at five bucks an hour and no sign up or annual fees. And renters really love that these dollars stay right in their local economy. Um, so first-time renters are screened before they can rent a car, and we only approve safe drivers. And uh, first-timers will also want to download our very soon-to-be-released uh, mobile app. And this will allow users to search, reserve, uh, and unlock cars directly from the smartphone. So during a reservation, um, you pull out your mobile phone, and it'll navigate you directly to the car. And one of the best parts of Relay Rides is that the, the car is located right in your neighborhood. Um, so uh, um, whenever the reservation is going, uh, just press unlock on the app to, uh, to unlock the car. Um, but it's fine if you don't have, uh, if, if you want people who doesn't have a smartphone quite yet, uh, you can lock the car with a text message as well. Um, and this is the really cool part, this is what we're really excited about, is that uh, to access the car, you don't have to install any special hardware in the car, you don't need a special fleet of vehicles like other car sharing services do. Um, but we're able to, um, uh, to connect with the OnStar API uh, and connect directly with the vehicle um, to make the rental as easy as possible for both the car owner and the borrower. Uh, with this partnership and access to the OnStar API, car sharing has really never been safer or more convenient. Um, and it, it allows people to utilize technology already in their car to directly connect with their neighbors for the benefit of the community and the environment. Really Rides was the, was the pioneer in peer-to-peer -peer car sharing, uh, and with this partnership, uh, it shows that we continue to be the most forward-thinking. We're seeing those rates, too, five, six dollars an hour. Does that include insurance? It does. A million dollar insurance policy. You can borrow my car. As long as it's not ghetto. <laughs> I'm there. We can it's a fun convertible. I love it. You can appreciate this if you're in an area like San Francisco where you don't have a vehicle and you can pick one up for the day to head downtown. Very cool. So when do we see a final concept? I'm counting the days. Uh, so we uh, will we'll be launching really early this year. So uh, stay tuned. Excellent. And we talk about a lot of car manufacturers have developed information platforms. Why is it important for you to team up with OnStar? Sure. You know, it, it feels like the networked car, the car as a platform, um, is becoming a buzzword these days. But, um, you know, uh, there are a couple of choices out there, but um, for us, OnStar was really the most, um, uh, the most attractive platform we could develop on. Uh, Linda talked about how uh, OnStar is the biggest connected platform out there with over six million customers. Um, and so it has the largest install base, and for a developer, that's really interesting. Um, and also, uh, it has the most robust in-vehicle features. So as opposed to just being able to display something on the screen, we can actually interact with the car. So, you know, we're really proud to be OnStar's first partner. And, and we're actually very excited um, about this first application, and we hope there's going to be many more coming in the future.
So if you're giving developers access to your platform, I imagine people are going to be worried and concerned about security risks. Yeah, we take security of our customers very seriously. Now, the way that our APIs are going to work is our APIs provide developers access to the OnStar Addicts <laughs> cloud server. And then the actual connection to the vehicle, we do that with our proprietary, robust, hardened system that we've used for all these years. And so, you know, we're taking this very, very seriously. When you started to talk about this new development, you asked uh, for ideas out there. Do you think you're going to get a lot of ideas in? Well, I think so. We're, we're, you know, we're going to see some great creative thought process that come from developers. They're going to come from customers talking to developers and saying, hey, can you do this for me? Remember, we have six million customers. Um, and while others are talking about these things and these things in the future, we're doing it right now. And so, you know, a lot of exciting times in front of us. I want to thank you, Shelby, for, uh, for helping us today. Thanks a lot. Exciting news. Thank you. Thank you.